Similarly to how we can use an array of fifths and octaves to derive and tune our Western scales, we can use stacks of other generating intervals repeated within larger period intervals to arrive at scales that are similarly consistent while having radically different structures. Often, the tuning is adjusted to better approximate intervals of just intonation, which have whole number frequency ratios between their pitches, resulting in purer harmonies when played with timbres that have harmonic overtones. Some common JI intervals include 5 to 4, the just major third, 3 to 2, the just perfect fifth, and 6 to 5, the just minor third. All intervals of just intonation, and indeed all rational numbers, can be described as a combination of prime factors. For instance, 5 to 4 can be written as 5 over 2 squared, and 6 to 5 can be written as 3 times 2 over 5. Likely because it appears so early in the harmonic series, and because the second harmonic is so prominent in the spectra of most instruments with harmonic overtones, the number 2 is involved in many of our most recognizable intervals of just intonation. It is possible, however, to make music by approximating intervals that don't involve the number 2 at all, which results in a situation where none of those aforementioned intervals is approximated. The most well-known example of such a system is Bull and Pierce tuning, which is often shortened to BP. Bull and Pierce is most often realized as 13 equal divisions of the tritive, where the tritive is the frequency ratio 3 to 1. The tritive, as you can probably tell from its name, is meant to replace the octave as the interval of equivalence, and so, if we want to derive Bull and Pierce with the 2D regular temperament, the tritive is the obvious choice for the period. The generator choice is not obvious, however, since 13 is a prime number, which means that the tuning could be generated by stacking any one of the 13 intervals it contains. Different generators will yield different MOS scales, and will require more or less chromatic use of those scales to access whichever harmonies we want to use most. The triad approximating the frequency ratio 3 to 5 to 7 is often suggested as a BP alternative to the major triad of Western tuning, which approximates 4 to 5 to 6. Generating Bolin Pierce with its approximation of 9 to 7, or its tritive inverse 7 to 3, results in MOS scales at 5 notes and 9 notes, with structures 4 large 1 small, and 4 large 5 small. The approximation of 5 to 3, which is the bottom half of the BP major triad, is reached by going up to 9 to 7 generators, and the approximation of 7 to 3, which is the outer interval of the BP triad, is reached by going down one generator and up one period, making the 3 to 5 to 7 triad relatively compact. Here's a short example whose melody is based on those MOS scales, and whose chord progression is in the style of a 12 bar blues, but with the 4 chord replaced by a chord one generator away from the tonic, and the 5 chord replaced by the chord a generator away from the tonic in the other direction. Tritive inversions of the 3 to 5 to 7 chord are used to facilitate smooth voice leading. Generating BP with its approximation of 7 to 5 results in 7 and 10 note MOS scales with structures 3 large, 4 small, and 3 large, 7 small. The 5 to 3 is reached by going down 6 generators and up 2 periods, and the 7 to 3 is reached by going down 5 generators and up 2 periods, making the 3 to 5 to 7 triad less compact than the previous method. Here's a short example whose melody is based on those MOS scales, and whose chord progression is in that same 12 bar blues style, using the new generator. Generating BP with its approximation of 5 to 3 results in 7, 9, and 11 note MOS scales with structures 2 large, 5 small,
two large, seven small. And two large, nine small. The 5 to 3 is, of course, reached by going up one generator. And the 7 to 3 is reached by going up six generators and down two periods, making the 3 to 5 to 7 triad as compact as it was with the previous method. Here's a short example whose melody is based on those MOS scales, and whose chord progression is in that same 12 bar blues style using the new generator. I look forward to more musicians exploring the admittedly alien landscape that is Bowling Pierce. Thanks for watching. If you liked this video, please feel free to share it on social media, hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and if you'd like to support this channel, then please consider pledging a dollar per video on my Patreon page. As a patron, you'll gain access to patron-only content like my Rubber Duck YouTube live streams and Patreon lens posts, and you'll get your name credited at the end of my videos. I'm always working on several long-term, high-effort projects, but do my best to post smaller weekly projects to keep things fresh. Thanks again.